Hello, Nathan Davis here again. Now I'm going to keep going with my number theory videos and show you some more neat stuff. Uh, now I'm going to kind of review, because there was something special I wanted to show you, about the numbers 4 and 7 and their special relationship. Alright, December 21st, 2012 at 11.11. Everybody knows that date. We thought it was going to, and we thought it was going to be the end of the world, but it totally wasn't. Uh, might be the start of the millennium that it prophesied about in the Bible at the end. Uh, more on that later. Okay. So, 4 and 7. Uh, December 21st, 12 and 21. These are both divisible by 3. 12 is 444. And 21 is 777. Okay. So that's cool. Uh, one, two, one, two, one. Uh, because the slash looks like a one. If you add these up, it's that equals seven. And if you add up all the ones, that equals four. Okay, you remember that? That's pretty cool. Okay. I showed you that you can flip numbers upside down. And uh, four and seven are the two numbers that don't flip. Okay, now sometimes there are what I like to call Easter eggs uh, in life, like mental Easter eggs, thing that, things that make you go, wow, how about that, that was cool. Um, this was one of those that I found. Uh, I was scrolling through, I think, my Facebook feed, and I saw this guy had cut open an eggplant, and the seeds looked like this, and they spelled God, and it just blew his mind. And I was like, whoa, that blows my mind, too, because... G and D, I mean, this is the same symbol, except, you know, uh, turned around. G is the seventh letter of the alphabet, and D is the fourth. And uh, this is just the last thing. I thought it was really cool. Uh, the Disney D backwards looks like a G. Four and seven. Wow. Okay, so I guess there's a little bit more. Um, I just happened to make this connection as I was putting this video together. Um, I took the 444777 from 1221 and I was like, well, wait a minute, what about 555666? And I just happened to think about it real quick and uh, something amazing happened. Look at this. 555 is 15 and 666 is 18. Alright. Now, I don't know if anything immediately jumps out at you, but to me, um, well, it should if you've been following through with the number theory videos. My birthday is 8-15, August 15th. So I thought that was quite cool. So 12-21 and 8-15, they're connected here again. Just like, uh, I hope you remember, where I showed you 3 and 5 and their special relationship and uh, 7 and 8 and their special relationship 8 3 5 3 plus 5 is 8 3 times 5 is 15 G 12 21 yeah so it's all pointing <laughs> to uh, to something really neat to me uh, okay, okay, so there's one more thing. We did the 555666, and I think, uh, hopefully this will drive it home. I figured it all out. 222 two, two, and 333. Three, three. Alright, what's up with this? This is 6 and 9. Now, I draw them differently, but if you look at them on the computer, they're like the same symbol, except rotated around. And uh, I've been saying that the universe has kind of been showing me for some time that Isaiah 9-6 might very well be talking about me as a person. So, yeah, if so, that would be quite incredible. Uh, whoa, hello. So, just something to think about.